So almost after three years, I pledged my backing on a crowdfunding campaign at Kickstarter. I have finally received a smart ring called Circular Ring. Now, what I was quite amazed initially when I saw the package is that not only comes with the main box, but also small accessory boxes. I know it looks quite cute, but the environment challenge that we are at the moment, I don't know whether someone will actually appreciate that. But then anyhow, that could be quite cool. So there's three boxes along with the uh, USB-C extension cable that is quite good quality indeed. So enough said, let's get into the unboxing. So here it goes. Nice, look at that. So a simple quick instruction with a QR code with an image and uh, this is the main bag, isn't it? So I think we got the actual charging uh, slot here. These are the two lines that actually you need to use for charging and I think that's the uh, monitoring sensor here. That's very clever, isn't it? So that is lining up with here. While it's that bit, you need to charge it with this unit here, the USB-C dongle. So that will, I presume, will be a magnetic joint. Sh should it be? So let's try it out here, shall we? Yep, so it joins here, so you can either plug it into your um, computer or any of the USB friendly devices, or you can actually use the extension cable if you need a longer cable. So that's very well done. Uh, on top of that, uh, ignore this one. So we've got three uh, slots here that I presume is for the uh, decoration of it, but I do actually like the black. But anyhow, let's try the other accessories, shall we? Ah, this is the um, silver finish. Now that is a nice one actually. This is the metallic black, probably going to be my favorite. Gold, okay. Look at that. That is quite a nice piece, isn't it? And this is something I don't understand and I predicted this is going to be the case where why can't we just have it one nice package delivered to us like that? So if I feel like the mood of a gold, all I need to do is slot this one in based on the uh, alignment here, like that, okay? So that will be a nice uh, gold piece ring. It's rather chunky, isn't it? Yep, it even fits in my thumb. Go on my ring like that. So yeah, that's even better, isn't it? There you go. So that's the silver one. And I can still see the bit of a black line. So I would much prefer the black. One thing I have immediately spotted is that you can see a bit of a scratch that is likely to cause by myself by taking these covers out. Okay, so I downloaded the app and it says that uh, the best finger to wear circular are in order as this, okay? So the thumb is the last one. And then it's also being advised to use the same finger all the time to monitor your uh, condition and if we press next uh, you got to also uh, put in your details so on the main page you can actually add um, so it says manage a circle so there's other function but as a default there's the alarm clock um, sleep analysis activity analysis and so on so if we were to press next it says um, quick access so these are the quick shortcuts that's quite cool and then these are the actual um, details that you can actually get burger menu okay what's that is that something of um, a calorie uh, like index and so on like that so if you press next these are the quick access menus so all those cool stuff and also the calendar to uh, check your updates and the um, adaptive feed as well sync your data as well so basically um, the smart ring will send all the data to it and um, I guess you could export it into some other form maybe and let's be friends and you could either choose to be an eco or a performance so I'll stick with the eco for a long lasting battery indeed and save so if we click on the manage circles these are the options that you can add which is the alarm clock um, guided breathing sleep analysis and activity analysis and live measurements. Okay, so those are quite cool. So if you go to the uh, alarm clock, you can actually decide uh, which sort of time um, and the uh, edit the vibration uh, pattern as well. How many times you repeat um, label, snooze, and that, that is quite cool. I, I kind of like that. That seems to be quite new to me for some reason. We could also do the um, sleep, 
analysis as well that's very cool activity analysis which is just the overall um, schedule uh, of what's been going on on your uh, lifestyle this is quite interesting actually this is the um, guided breathing so there's different sessions so 478 which is the improve rest and sleep uh, this is for stress related 444 relieve your stress and 5 15 10 recovery so if i say i'm a bit stressed if i were to press that one so let's say three two one um it says wow it was vibrating and it says breathe in <sighs> hold your breath breathe out oh that's very cool okay so you feel the vibration okay hold your breath breathe in <sighs> Hold your breath, breathe out, okay. I don't know whether it's monitoring my uh, pulse, by the way. I'm supposed to breathe in later. Okay, hold your breath, breathe out. Okay, that's quite challenging. Very good, actually. It also shows the resting heart rate and heart rate um, you know, variability as well and so on so that was good response as well so that is quite unique from the other health uh, device wearable device that i am aware of and i'm sure you could use the sleep and the recovery but i have to say the vibration itself is quite effective it is like a nice reminder it's like vroom, 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 and actually vibrates through all your um, finger actually so let's do the live measurement as well i think this is the final feature so okay it's on good so the heartbeat is 70. Okay, that's gone way down. Normally I'm about 100 to 120, but it says the activity intensity is um, rest, good. And uh, maximum HR is 35% and the HRV 45. So it's gone up 55 and oxygen level of 95.9. I don't know whether that's supposed to be good or not. So on the left top, you got the three lines. So if you actually press on that, you got the profile, calendar, quick access, leaderboard, settings, learn and store. But if we go to the leaderboard, all right, so you can share that with the um, other people actually using it. And then lastly, if we scroll down, there's this calibration um, and then some questionnaires that you need to respond as well. I think if something goes wrong, the app will say, what's wrong, you know? Um, can you come back to us? That is really cool. So the immediate uh, impression is that the default plastic unit itself, it easily gathers scratch. So unfortunately those scratches actually are um, focused on the main central bit where the sensor is. So you could easily see the scratch. That's a bit of an um, unfortunate one. The biggest concern is that I actually thought I correctly measured the thickness of my finger, but it is very uh, loose so I might lose it while I'm actually concentrating on something else. So there's a bit of a danger there. So hopefully I won't, but um, we shall see how it goes. But then again, it has to be, uh, you know, loose enough for you to take it off and then charge it as well. So there's a bit of a balance here and there. But anyhow, the actual app itself is pretty impressive. Um, I do like the sleep analysis function. Um, if you don't want to wear the a health uh, band like Xiaomi kind of stuff. You could also wear this um, activity analysis. Uh, guided breathing was pretty cool and the live measurement as well. But the main thing about this whole thing is that this is actually two years old technology. If we actually received it two years ago, this will be a wow factor kind of thing. But this is actually uh, can be replaced with um, even uh, like smartwatches like Apple smartwatches and so on as well. So um, if you're an Android user, I guess um, this um, like unless like on like Samsung or something like that, that has all these functions already. But if you have like tag oil like myself, which has limited health monitoring, then this will be a perfect solution for it. But overall, again, uh, these sort of things are now easily being combined with your smart watches if you have one. So, um, but it's a good concept. A again, I wish I actually have received this two years ago, then it will be a really fantastic product. But 
yeah, why not? But if you don't have any smartwatch and if you want to have a nice decorative sort of black gold silver ring, then this will be another solution. So I hope this video sort of helped you understand what circular smart ring is. But if you have any queries, please do comment below. And thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye bye.